What's good, man? It's your boy Taylor. We are back with another episode of Televisions, man. Today, we're going to be showing y'all why you should be using strobes with your film. Let's get into it. Before we even start this video, man, I want to give a big shout out to my homie Sean for allowing me the privilege to shoot his birthday photos. <laughs> like, I've been shooting his photos for about some years now, bro. Like, I'm going to let y'all check out some of his older photos. Let me know what y'all think. So, this was from... I want to say it was like 2018 and then I ended up taking these when me and him used to be roommates at our apartment so we got some decent stuff and you can see the growth and you can see like my style like how it's evolved so much today man we starting off at Cam Kirk Studios at the home you feel me so we're doing some nice film you know what I'm saying we starting off with Ektar 100 I haven't shot this film in so long and be mindful when you are shooting this film this film does give off a reddish feel on skin tone. So I do remember heavily in post when we were shooting and sometimes I have to dial back that red a little bit because with his skin tone, it made him look more red than light skin. Some people have a thing about editing film and how it's supposed to look, but I don't want my homie to be out here looking like Rudolph, you feel me? So I really was in my bag, man. And like, I love doing shoots like these, especially for the homies because with especially it being free like you know i always show love to the homies but especially with that aspect it allows me to put even more passion into it and then i could get willy nilly with it, you know i could get freaky with it you feel me so i ended up putting two lights in the background and had them shining on the backdrop so i had a green and an orange i feel like that was gonna match his jacket perfectly and then i wanted to get two snoops so i got two spotlights i got one aimed at him and i got one aimed at his feet so check out this photo I lost some of my feet. It's fire. But all right, bet. That's cool. Hold that. Hold on. Hit the test line real quick. Brax, which lights didn't go off? Let me see one time. Do it one time. Now put your chin up. Yeah. Now look. Oh, yeah, that's cool. One. Two. Fire. I want you to be in that same position. I want you to throw it to M now. So I had the umbrella as my key light and then I used two soft boxes in the back to light up the backdrop so we can get like this big white looking like basically this is a setup that I will use when I'm doing product photography when I'm shooting digital. This is also a dope lighting concept if you want to do e-commerce work or something that's a little bit more commercial. So with him specifically I had him do some standing up and then I had him do something sitting down on the floor. So check these out. Say so what? Two. Ektar 100 wasn't a bad film stock, but definitely if I'm shooting more in studio, I would definitely use something with a higher speed or just something that's not as warm because the redness on the skin tone. Like, the shoot came out nice. Overall, I think it's a dope shoot, don't get me wrong, but I definitely would look for something different that isn't really airing on that side. This isn't my first time shooting with Ektar 100, but I definitely had an experience before where I felt the same way. I was like, I really don't like this redness on the skin. But you know, pros and cons, it really depends on your style at the end of the day. So next time I'll probably use some Portra 400 or some Portra 800. Or honestly, it'll be something that gives it a little bit more color or so probably like some Ektachrome. But other than that, like the shoot went well. I really enjoyed it, man. And he was happy about the photos and it looked very, very nice, man. 
with that being said man i appreciate y'all for tuning in in today's video make sure you comment below let me know if you enjoyed this video if you are new man welcome make sure you subscribe join into the family man we got consistency all around the board on this channel so make sure you check us out and also too man don't forget the main thing keep shooting peace